Right, then year six, we are on to part two of our slightly differently organised lesson. Um, so we are talking about capacity, volume, litres and millilitres for this one. So one litre is equal to a thousand millilitres, that was on your supporting hands. Meal, oh, that is not the pen that I was expecting. Meal is actually a thousand in French, so hopefully you can see we've got millilitres, a thousand. Millilitres <coughs> are smaller than litres, sorry. They are 1,000 times smaller, okay? So if we've got litres, which is what we indeed have over here, and we want to convert it into millilitres, we need to multiply by 1,000, okay? So to convert from litres to millilitres, we multiply by 1,000. We'll do that bit first, I think, before we look at this next bit. So we've got 8.25 litres. We need to multiply that by a thousand. Now, if you need to, you can do the nine method. One, two, three places, three zeros, three jumps, etc. Line your decimal point up. So we're going to move eight, two, five. And then we've got our ones column here, which is going to need a placeholder zero in it. So we end up with 8,250 millilitres, which is, oh, wrong one which is hopefully what we've got under there. There we go. So 8,250 millilitres. Hopefully you can see that it's lined up. Now, if you can remember this 1,000 millilitre business, then actually you might not need the line method because hopefully you can see there, that's got to be 8,000. Eight times 1,000 is 8,000. And then everything else would just follow on, okay? So you might not need the line method if you can see that. Right, we can go the other way as well. So to convert from millilitres to litres, this time we need to do the opposite. So to convert from millilitres to litres, we're going to divide by a thousand. So this time we'd be going three jumps to the right if we needed the line method, okay? And again, there's a nice little diagram for you, which is also on the next slide. Here we are. So if you can manage to say it, whisper it, shout it, write it down on whatever you are using, type it out, whatever you need to do. So there are 1,000 millilitres in a litre, okay? 1,000 millilitres in a litre. You need to remember this for the rest of your lives, people. It would be an idea to copy this one down as well, just so you can remember, make yourself a little poster maybe. So litres, we times by 1,000 to get millilitres. And if we've already got the millilitres, we divide by a thousand to work out how many litres there are. OK, so the next bit is intelligent practice for volume capacity. OK, and um, so I'll just go through a couple with you. So to get from this two litres to the millilitres, we're just going to times by a thousand. So two times by a thousand, essentially. Hopefully you might not need the line method for that one. And then if you have a look at this one, this goes back the other way. So we've got the millilitres. We need to get to litres, so we need to divide that one by a thousand. Again, you might be able to see here, this 3,000 here has got to be three litres. So if you can get to the three whole litres, everything else just follows on. Okay, so if you can get that one. Just be careful with this one down here, a little bit of a challenge there. 12 litres and 50 millilitres. So just be careful with that one when you convert it. And then we've got a spot the mistake for your reasoning problem. 3,504 millilitres is 3.54 litres. There is a mistake there. Can you figure out what it is? So just like the last test, these answers are on purple mesh. Um, but I'll also show you them on the next side of the video and maybe just go through a couple of bits with you. OK, so do make sure you've paused and you've had a go um, before you look at the answer slide. All right, there we go. So hopefully you got that 2000 one without too much trouble. And then this one down here, I just said to be careful of. So you've got 12 litres. That's 12,050. OK. And then the mistake one, 3,504 millilitres is actually 3.504 litres. You can't get rid of this zero here. It's got a value to it because of this four. So that's an important zero. We need that. It's not a zero that's gone off the end over here. You can't take it out. So it's actually 3.504. It's just started absolutely shocking it down here. Oh, there we go. But still somehow sunny. Very strange. 
Um, all right. So after that, then we're on to part number three, which will be about length. So your meters, centimeters, etc. So join me for that next video. See you in a moment.